And this Saturday is going to be a very special day. It's the fourth annual Nathan Cirillo Memorial Cup Challenge taking place. Uh, we find out more right now. We say hello to Barbara Boucher, the director of Boots for Pups. And it's uh, wonderful to have you here. Uh, and uh, we also have uh, Catherine Arsenault with us as well, who is ex-military. And you've brought your friend uh, Sammy here uh, as well. Uh, we're going to find out uh, more about uh, Boots for Pups. We'll get you to grab your mic right there. Boots for Pups, and uh, we'll say hi to Sammy. So maybe, Catherine, you can uh, introduce us to Sammy. Well, this is Sammy. She's three and a half years old, golden retriever. She's in training, and she just smelled something food. <laughs> yeah, it smells pretty good in Sit. here. Give That's great. Yeah. There we go. And Barbara, nice to have you back on the program as yeah, well. Yeah, thanks, So John. can you give us a quick uh, history <laughs> of uh, Boots for Pups? Well, we've been in Ottawa now for almost five years. Mm -hmm. uh, we're a chapter of the Citadel Canine Society, which is based in Vancouver. Mm -hmm. We are a nonprofit organization. And we raise funds throughout the year to train dogs for military vets and first responders who are ailing from PTSD and OSI. Mm -hmm. Then we donate the dog in the end. Really? Okay. We do two good things. We rescue a dog from a shelter, number one, across Canada. And then we donate it. So, My goodness. Yes. That's something. So Lots Sammy's story then? Sammy is... Uh, actually, I own Sammy. Okay. And uh, I heard about Boots for Pups and uh, asked about it. And... Uh, I'm being trained, she's uh, being trained by Rachel Savage Yeah. In Gatineau, she's stationed in Gatineau, yeah. and she's been uh, trained for about a year, she's still in training. In training, That's yeah. great, okay, <laughs> aren't we all though, right? Okay, so can yeah. I ask you uh, uh, the goal uh, reached by most of your events, obviously fundraising. Yes. Because you, you need to get some funds to come in. Yeah. It's not super cheap to train a dog. No, we, we're fortunate that we have great trainers who dedicate their time here in Gatineau, Ottawa, in North Bay, in uh, Oakville, um, training a dog is about 3500 to 5000 hmm. for us. I mean, it's not always like that. Mm -hmm. So every event that we do, we, every penny counts. Um, we do barbecues and we do uh, comedy night shows. And mm -hmm. our Cirillo event is our year-end event, okay. which is very important to us because it's in Nathan Cirillo's memorial namesake. Of course. And he loved rescue dogs, so Did that's he? why. Yes, that's why we have his namesake from his family. So that's we're important. really happy about that. Okay, so let's go through the the events of the day. It's not too far off; a couple of days away. <laughs> Two are, days. Are you ready? Yeah, we are. Yeah. We are. Yes, we are. So what's going to be taking place? We have a canoe and kayak event, which is just challenge yourself to be on the water with other people. It's not a race. It's challenge yourself to be out there. Mm -hmm. You know, which is hard for PTSD and uh, recipients who are ailing from OSI to be out in public. Mm -hmm to go outside and enjoy life like we do enjoy life. Mm -hmm. uh, throughout the event, there'll be 50-50 draws, there'll be um, uh, a silent auction, which we do very well. And this year, we incorporated the Kiwanis Club of Rito, a uh, dog fashion show. A dog fashion show, mm -hmm. okay. That's probably gonna be the cutest event ever. I think so. <laughs> Happening at the Rito Canoe Club, a Hogsback Drive. Can I ask you, Catherine, why did you decide to go uh, to Boots for Pups? Why, why was it so important for you to do this? Well, I've heard the great things that they do for the veterans and uh, first responders, and uh, I, I, being a sufferer of PTSD, need uh, to help to go outside, out of the house, to get into the real world. Mm -hmm. And uh, Sammy's bitten a true, uh, truly a trooper in yeah. helping me with that. So Sammy's really helped. You can, you can oh, really yeah. testify it's like, here. Yeah, it's yeah. Like day and night. And anyway. you spent 14 years in the military as well. Yes, yeah, so 14 so years. thank you. Yeah. That, that's yeah. great, great service. Uh, can we talk about um, where exactly it, it, the, the training happens for the dogs? North Bay, correct? We have a big facility in North Bay, mm -hmm. but Sammy's been trained in Gatineau with okay. one of our trainers, uh, Rachel Savage. Okay. So we do have trainers here in Ottawa. Okay, but for the most part, I mean, the Boots for Pups Citadel Canine Society is based out of North Bay? No, it is it an isn't. Ottawa chapter. We were fortunate enough to get on board with CHIP, from K-9 Obedience and Training uh, Program, and he opened up a facility there to help us out also. So we're mm -hmm. trying to do the same thing here in Ottawa. Mm -hmm. So that's our next plan, is to have another big facility here in Ottawa. How many uh, veterans would you say you've helped at this point, this whole We have probably uh, 30 dogs right now across Ontario uh, from Boots for Pups, and 100 across Canada. That's something else. I know. It's, it's something to be proud of for sure. Yes. Uh, now, am I saying this correct, the Tau Kappa Epsilon fraternity. Yes. I've never been part of a fraternity. Clearly. Oh my God. Um, yes, they are <laughs> great. This is a great uh, group of uh, students at the Carleton University who take on charities while they're doing their, their stint in the university. And uh, they chose Boots for Pups as one of them. So they've been helping us out 
pull these events together, uh, manpower. So mm -hmm. we have great volunteers. They're just That's fabulous. Wonderful. So volunteers obviously is a big part of what yes. you do. Oh, yes. Okay, so funds, volunteers. So if people can't make it then, obviously, uh, to the events that are happening on Saturday, I mean, uh, you're obviously open yes. to, to getting people on board. Yeah, yeah. And you can just come up and, like, and register at the last minute. We, I heard Ottawa is the last minute registration capital, so we're yeah. open for registration at 9.30. It's a full day of event this year. We're going till 4, 4.30. Mm -hmm. A lot of vendors and a lot of mental health uh, um, vendors there also that will be uh, participating with us. And Catherine, will Sammy be there? At this oh, event? Oh, yeah, she'll Good. be there, yeah. Good. You can meet a TV star at this event yeah. that's coming up, for sure. <laughs> Boots4, the number 4, pups.ca for more information on this great organization. And uh, best of luck on a Saturday for a great cause in honor of a great name as well. Thank you very much for being here today. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Sammy. There you go. That's lots of fun. Uh, details on Savor the Senses coming up in moments right here on Daytime Rogers TV.